From videos to live streams, when it comes to covering an Animal Crossing character, Lucky has been one of the most requested for me to cover, and it's easy to see why. All you have to do is look at him. Lucky is a lazy dog villager who is almost fully wrapped in bandages. His left eye can be seen peeking through his bandages. The fur around his eye, on his ears, and his tail are all black. But of course, the fur isn't what's got people interested. Now, before we go any further on what Lucky's backstory is, I need to discuss something with you. And that something is named Walker. A lot of people have speculated that Lucky is an undead version of Walker, as the color of their ears and tails are the same, they both have lazy lazy personalities, and the difference of the numbers on their default shirts is 44, a number foreboding death in some East Asian superstitions. Now as fun as this theory is, I personally don't believe it, and I don't because I recorded this. As you can see, on my wife's island here, she has Lucky as a villager, and Walker is staying at the campsite, and since they are on the same island at the same time, they are not the same character. Plus why would Walker change his name to Lucky after death? There really is no reason here. So yeah, I personally do not believe that Lucky and Walker are the same character. And with that theory out of the way, it's time to discuss our main topic for today. What is Lucky's backstory? And just why is he bandaged up? Let's get started. I have to start this off by saying Lucky is either a very ironic character as their name is also ironic because he is covered in bandages, or their name is a joke on the saying, lucky to be alive. I say this because Lucky isn't so lucky. You can tell this simply by reading his pocket camp character info. It's rare to meet someone who fails to live up to his name so spectacularly, but Lucky doesn't seem to mind, so maybe he's pretty lucky after all. There's even more evidence to how unlucky Lucky is, as Lucky's default shirt is the number 23 shirt, which may be a reference to the 23 Enigma, a phenomenon relating to misfortune to the number 23, kinda like that weird Jim Carrey movie. So yeah, Lucky is unlucky. So why is he in bandages? Well my viewers, I actually have an answer for that. And it comes straight from Nintendo this time. The e-reader is an accessory for the Game Boy Advance and was first released in Japan in 2001 and in North America in late 2002. The e-reader scans e-cards, which have dot codes that grant items and minigames. However, we are going to be discussing the villager cards. These show villager information about them and a dot code. Scanning them will grant a letter from the villager containing an item. But what's most important here is the villager information as it will tell us what exactly happened to Lucky. As the e-reader card says, which I remind you was a Nintendo product, which pretty much makes this canon, Lucky took luck into his own hands when he went on that fateful fishing trip last week, between casting his rod too far, snagging his line on a rock, and losing his balance and falling overboard, Lucky's luck held true to form. Based on the e-reader card, and all the evidence mentioned before, Nintendo has pretty much spelled out how unlucky Lucky is, and they have even just told us why Lucky is covered in bandages. So here's how I believe it went down for Lucky. Lucky is a very unlucky dog. Now we are unsure why this is. It could be a curse, maybe something linked to the 23 Enigma, or maybe his parents accidentally jinxed him by giving him the name Lucky. But one thing's for sure, Lucky's bandages are a result of his misfortune. As was said on the e-reader card, during a fishing trip, Lucky cast his rod too far, snagged his line on a rock, and then he lost his balance and fell overboard. Now there are no details to his fall, like how far he fell, and even though we do not have his medical files, we do finally have an answer for what we were looking for. Lucky isn't a mummy or an undead walker. He is just a rather unlucky dog who was injured during a fishing accident, which led to most of his body needing to be bandaged up. Now, as unfortunate as this sounds, having to wear bandages on your whole body, Lucky doesn't seem to mind. If anything, he seems to be just as happy as everyone else, leading me to believe that Lucky doesn't see himself as unlucky. To compare him to someone in real life, meet Frank Select, the luckiest unlucky person on earth. He is a Croatian man who has allegedly escaped death seven times. Times. He's said to have survived a train crash, a plane crash, and a car crash. Hence why he is named the luckiest unlucky man alive. And this is how I feel Lucky's life is. In reality, maybe he isn't unlucky. Instead, maybe he's just lucky to be alive. And I believe this is why Lucky is so cool with all of this. I feel he's just happy to be alive. 
which is why he doesn't care that he has bandages all over him, as he gets the opportunity to live and experience what life has to offer, even when life throws misfortune at him. He gets through it and smiles to see another day. And I think this is a good lesson for all of us, even with everything happening right now in the world. Sometimes we need to sit back and realize just how fortunate we are to have this life and to experience what this world has to offer. And because Lucky is able to survive these misfortunes, to have the opportunity to continue with his life is possibly why he is actually lucky. Plus that Frank Select Man eventually won the lottery, so maybe Lucky will win a big one one of these days. So he possibly has that to look forward to. But hey guys, that was the backstory on the character Lucky. I hope you enjoyed. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, and if you're new, please subscribe for updates on future content. Plus if you want to support the channel further, you can visit my Patreon or my merch store. Also if you want to keep more up to date with me, you can follow me on any of my social medias. But guys, I just want to thank you all so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. And and I will see you all next time. <laughs>